Hey, what's going on everybody, Geronimo22. Just coming back with a quick video. Just kind of want to give you guys a little bit of a heads up on something that I'm going to try. I have a game tonight against a pretty good guy. Um, I'm going to work a little bit of quarters cover six, Zeus, okay? So Zeus is a call that is in their system where we're going to play the cover two side to the top receiver. And if the top receiver is aligned outside at number one, that's where the cover two will be. If he's aligned inside the slot, then we would play quarters, okay? Now, the thing that I'm going to also attempt a little bit here is I'm not going to fall cover six and cover nine, even though they are in my audibles. You see here I have cover six, cover nine, and quarters. Why? Well, because if you look at these shells, they actually show the coverage, right? So cover six against any coverage right here, any formation, two by two. You can see how the weak safe, the weak corner is down, right? And this corner is back. So anybody who reads coverages knows that this is a cover six look. Okay, there's some other little clues in here too that I put on my Patreon. You guys know how to read coverages based off of reading all the players on the field, okay? And then if I was to come out in cover nine, somebody would know why. Well, because of the same thing, right? You have, let's say you have a corner that's down, right, to one side and the other because most cover nines are built out of the show two coverage. So a lot of people would know that, hey, there's a good chance that it's cover two or cover nine. And then if it's quarters, well, Everybody's playing off, right? So now what? You know, they know it's most likely court is coverage. Now, from a simplicity standpoint, guys, if you guys want to execute the defense correctly, perfectly fine. Not mad at you. Do that. But what I'm going to do is try to attempt to call quarters coverage or palms, depending on how I want it to play out. And I'm going to play stuff. So again, let's review what stuff is. I mean, not stuff. Zeus. Zeus is a combination of cover six, okay? Cover nine, technically, in the Madden world. But in their world, they don't call it that. They just call it, cover, actually, they, have, they call it cover eight, okay? So what we would do here is, let's say 81 on the right-hand side. This is an old roster here. I don't know how this got loaded up. C.D. Lamb over here, okay, is the guy that we want to make sure that we always play our cover two side, we roll coverage to that side, right? So what we're gonna do here is take this corner and put him into whatever you want, a clawed flat, a soft squat, doesn't matter, okay? It just depends on how you want it to play out. From a coverage standpoint, you can also put him into a hard flat, all right? This safety here, you put him into a deep half, okay? And then you take this linebacker and you just put him into a hunk curl, okay? Oops. Didn't mean to do that. Okay. So now we have our roll coverage side to the side where the receiver is that we want to um, play. Okay. On the opposite side, we're playing quarters coverage. Okay. If you wanted to play palms coverage or in their system, they call it a read. It would be a read between one, two, and th one between the corner, the safety, and the nickel on one and two, you play palms. And you do the same thing. But the great thing here and why we're here today is just to talk about this shell. You can see how the corners are both off at about seven to eight yards and they're off and you're not sure, okay? Now, there are some downsides to this where you're not going to be able to get a jam ever really on your corners, on your outside guys. That kind of stinks, but you can go from there. Now, the other thing that you can do here is now we can also play around with some press positioning if you feel comfortable with doing that, right? on both sides, or on one side, you can kind of really mix it up. So that's something that I want to recommend to you guys. It's a really simple thing. 
I'm going to run a lot of it. So you're going to see my numbers go up tremendously when it comes to quarters and palms. In this Vic Fangio defense, there's times you have to make some changes now. We got to make some motor. We got to make some hot routes. We got to get used to doing that. So we got to be good with our global hot routing and get it done that way. All right. So this was this wasn't a video to really kind of go over specifically the system. I'm kind of saving that and I'm still working on it. I've, I've made about maybe 20 videos already, and because I'm learning the system on the fly, I always realize there's probably a better way to teach it or a better way to say it. So that's why you're getting videos kind of slow right now. But I wanted to just give you a little bit of a heads up. So if you watch my games and you see a lot of quarters coverage popping up, it's not always quarters. Sometimes it's cover nine. I'm sorry. Sometimes it's cover eight in their system, which is cover nine in Madden, or it's cover six, or it's quarters. Okay. So just be ready for that. And um, if you guys have any questions, comments, come over to the Patreon, talk to me. You can talk to me over there anytime you want, or you can leave some comments in the video below. And uh, I'll talk to you later, man. Peace.